You know, I think that it's very clear that there's a lot of big things on the horizon for Chapel Run and her team. Um, this is the last stop, I believe, of this uh, portion of the tour for this summer. Um, and I expect to see her moving into bigger venues like CHI, um, PBA, especially with her commanding the crowd perform at all of her other festival performances this year. Um, I think that this is just uh, finishing up uh, a solid run of down to her roots before she goes into the major league. I can't speak on behalf of the artist for sure, but I think that being a Midwesterner from Missouri and the setting of this place, I think is something rem reminiscent of home, the early days, how things got started. I couldn't really tell you, but I just feel like there's something special about this location and being from the Midwest. And uh, we've heard that, you know, she can be kind of a country girl. She likes to be out in nature and be around. So it's really hard to tell. I'm uh, not really sure what I would say. <laughs> As, uh, as event managers, do you get to be excited about this? What Absolutely. Um, I'm excited, um, as always, just to see the community coming together and sharing in this experience together. Um, I saw my first concert when I was 11 years old and I was immediately swept up in it. Uh, I just loved the idea of all these people coming together um, and feeling a certain way about what they're seeing together. The unity has been something that's driven me in this industry from day one. And that's my ex most exciting part about putting these events together is seeing the crowd in here enjoying a once in a lifetime experience.